<laughs> oh, you already know the vibe, huh? Sure. Okay, let's see what happens, right? Let's just do, let's do a Damocles run as Eden. Let's take Guillotine as well. I'm going full on Zane today. I've decided I want to go with the Zane. What, what's the worst that could happen? Oh, I get hit in the first, uh, I don't know, eight seconds of the run and lose? Well, uh, don't say I didn't warn you. But also, come on, that was kind of bullshit. <laughs> I would argue that damage was almost unavoidable, to be honest. I, just all oh, I'm saying, man. So I'm saying. God, I never should have taken guillotine, but I needed it for the tears up. But also, God, it's such an annoying item. I hate it. I hate the guillotine. What the hell? Anyway, hope you're having a good day. All the usual stuff. I don't know how long this run is gonna last, but here's here's hoping it lasts a little bit longer. It really it really puts you on a timer, you know, getting Damocles as a starting item and then using it straight away and seeing where it takes you. Look, all I need is a respawn item and I'll be fine. This run will actually live if I get a respawn item. Or I get jump scared by Damocles dropping on me. And I'm trying to just set myself up for, like, comedic timing on that pretty much at every waking moment. Because it would be hilarious if it happened. So I'm saying. It would be very funny if it were to happen. Dude, you know what could fucking make my day right now? Fucking tractor beam. If that wanted to show up, my life would be so good. Ow. I, I didn't really know how I was gonna dodge yet, to be honest. At this point, getting hit doesn't really matter to me anymore, considering I've already gotten hit once. Like, any hit past the first one, once you've gotten Damocles, is really just a, a bonus to making your life harder or whatever. Oh god, this isn't going anywhere, brother. Oh god. Oh, he blew himself up huge. Huge stuff. I ain't got no damn keys, brother. Can I, can I buy one? I don't really want to waste all my time, but can I can I buy one? <laughs> Might as well. Seems like a seems like a good idea, right? Look, if by some miraculous measure, I can make it to my first devil deal. There's a nine lives in there. We're saved. Everything is good. However, given my current stand of HP, but also the fact that I have to somehow get through this without getting hit, and I have guillotine, I doubt that that will happen. <laughs> I have sincere doubts about the validity or possibility of any of those claims. I, I, I've reminded myself again why I never take guillotine, man. That shit's got me messed up right now. It's got me absolutely fricked up. It makes it impossible to dodge, brother. Oh, from my item room, please. Thank you. This is what I was looking for anyway. Well, I guess I'll take you and I'll take you because you're passive. That's how it's gonna be. Okay. Well, I mean, there's no point in really going to the shop. I don't have money for it anyway. Should I really be wasting my time? My precious time that I have left? With Damocles dangling over my head, threatening to kill me at any second, shooting all these poops? Absolutely not. I should not be doing that. And yet here I am, doing it anyway. Because I can. It is blub. My damage output do be kind of nasty, to be honest. Like, if I hit some of my shots, like, once my guillotine stops being, like, extremely omega cringe. Ah, well, there goes my deal. <laughs> I, uh, I actually do quite a lot of damage. Thanks for the massive tears ups, though. I appreciate those plenty. I should... Should I? I should. Maybe there's a soul heart in here. Uh, or this, which is a justice card. And I don't have keys, so I'm gonna kill myself. Um, I cannot leave the room. <laughs> I believe I have soft locked myself? Huh? Okay, no, I can just do that. There you go. Okay, that was, uh, yeah, I don't know what- I don't know what that was all about, man. That was a bit strange. Can't say I've had that happen before. I don't know why I used the Justice card immediately. For some reason, I thought I had keys, which, well, evidently, I do not. Keep it, keep it going, babe. Oh, there my, there's my item room straight away. I need myself a key, please. Still nothing. Let's fight the boss. Is Rainmaker at least a somewhat manageable boss? Okay, I got hit anyway. Again, blame Guillotine for that one. Don't know why I took it, but I was desperate, okay? I was desperate for DPS. Of course, I didn't get a deal. Would have surprised me if I did. <clears throat> Would have been very surprising. That being said though, man, the run is going so fine right now. <laughs> have Who knew uh, having all of your items duplicated makes the game easier? What? No way, dude. I never would have thought of that one at all. Man, wouldn't it be funny if the sword dropped right now and I died? Wouldn't it be hilarious if Damocles dropped on top of me this very instant and I lost the run? Wouldn't it be funny if I did this entire run? Just expecting it to drop and then it never actually does. That would be the opposite, right? That would also be really funny if that were to happen. Or at least if it were to drop after I get like a 1-up or something like that, which I would love to see. 
but I know will not happen because the game hates me. It's a curious little uh, detail, by the way. I don't know how many people notice. When you kill the Rainmaker on the downpour, look at what happens to like the, you know, like see the water all dripping down in the arena right now? See, watch what happens when you kill him. Goes away. Ain't that curious? And that a curious little detail, because you killed the Rainmaker, so the rain stops, at least in, in the boss room. I wonder how many people have ever paid attention to that. Uh, it took me a while to figure that out. Yeah, this does get doubled huge, okay. I like it. I like getting items out the ass thanks to, <laughs> thanks to Damocles. That's incredible, man. It is a great sight to behold. I get to grab two more items of my choosing, and I already know which ones they're gonna be. It's gonna be you, and it's gonna be you. No, 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 no. Nope, not, not taking that. I'm so hesitant to waste any form of conversation or banter on this run right now, knowing full damn well it could end in an instant at any moment, which will both be hilarious, but also a sad, sad day. But it's been 10 minutes, man. It's been 10 minutes and the run, the run hasn't ended yet. You know, it's uh, it, it only gets more likely, except the likelihood of every second it dropping is the same. It's just that, you know, over time, you'd think that eventually it should drop. But I guess if I keep moving and keep going fast enough, maybe it won't happen? Who knows? Maybe this has given me, like, a false sense of confidence as well. Now that, you know, it's already been 10 minutes and the damn sword hasn't dropped yet, I'm like, maybe I won't ever die. Maybe I will be invincible forever. Maybe there is nothing to fear. What do we got in here? Whoa! Some good stuff. Piercing is gonna go huge with uh, Shield of Tears, and obviously a Tears Up that breaks the Tears Cap is always nice. I got my deal! I am... saved, perhaps? Uh, not really. <laughs> not really! I was really hoping to find, like, a 1-up or something. The money goes power. It's not, it's, it's not worth it, but I'll take it anyway. Fuck it. I'm not even gonna do the rest of the floor, I'll just leave. <clears throat> I'm out of here. Dude, this is going on for way too long. I, I hate this. I hate that it's going on for so long. What the hell, man? I was expecting this run to die by now. Every waking moment is anxiety. Anyway, here's something kind of crazy that I realized the other day. Because uh, I was talking about ads right on one of these runs. And in retrospection, I, I realized something about... Because I was like, I don't really watch TV anymore, like at all, right? I haven't watched television since I was a kid. And even back when I was a kid, the ads on TV would always piss me off like crazy. Because like you're watching something on TV, whatever it may be, whatever TV show. And then, you know, you watch like 10 minutes of it and suddenly there's an ad. There's like 5 minutes of ads in between. And it's like, TV advertising... Like you complain about like mobile ads and like, you know, all that shit on YouTube nowadays. But TV advertising back in the day was fucking crazy, man. It was asinine, it was loud. They were always trying so desperately to get your attention with something. And it was obviously always completely irrelevant, right? Like, say what you want about modern-day online advertising. First of all, the fact that you can choose to block it in most places is already a fucking blessing. But even if you do see the ads, most of the time they're a little targeted, which is a blessing and a curse, but at least they're kind of relevant to you, so at the very least, maybe... Maybe for once the ads will actually do their job and show you something that could be of interest to you, right? Which is the whole point of advertising at the end of the day. Even if I hate ads, it makes sense. That's all aside though. I, what I found crazy was that I, I like I was reminded of like a little bit of pe a bit of trivia about how television works here. Because in Germany we have we have the public channels that are basically funded by the taxpayer, and there's a bunch of them, and they almost never run ads. At least. Pot, like at certain times of the day, they never run ads. And then we have the private channels, which are just private studios that have a broadcasting license and they broadcast on their channels and they have, you know, rights to shows and all that stuff, like sitcoms and all that stuff. But the important thing is they run ads all the time. They run like a five minute ad break every 15 minutes or something like that, right? What's crazy to me is that the public channels, you know, the government channels effectively, broadcast in HD. That's HD television, right? High definition television, as you'd expect, because high definition has been around for ages now. The uh, private channels don't, because I guess it's too expensive or whatever, but they do have an HD version of their broadcast. However, those aren't free. The normal versions of the private channels are free to watch. Anybody who has a satellite receiver can, well, watch those TV channels. However, the private ver uh, the, the HD versions, you have to pay for. You have to uh, pay a subscription or whatever to be able to, well, decrypt, de decrypt <laughs> decode those channels because the signal's encrypted or whatever, right? Fair enough, I suppose. What's crazy to me about that is the fact that those HD channels run the exact same broadcast as the free ones, the non-HD ones, which means they still run the ads. So not only are you paying to watch 
the HD version of a channel, which is already crazy because you can just watch whatever those channels broadcast in HD on streaming services on demand nowadays, which is why I think television is a dying medium. But on top of it, they still run ads. So not only are you paying to watch ads, you're paying to watch... Not only are you paying to watch something that you could just get for free, or like, at least, you know, on demand, you're also paying to watch ads. That's crazy to me. The fact that they still run ads on the, the basically paid channels is wild. That's absolutely insane. Like, on most places online or anywhere, right, not getting ads by paying is a big perk. Many mobile apps, if you buy a premium version, you don't see ads. If you buy the premium service of, say, YouTube, you don't see ads if you buy YouTube Premium, right? Instead of just using an app blocker. If you subscribe to a Twitch streamer, you don't see ads on their channel anymore. You know, if you pay money, you don't have to see ads. That's the whole, that's like the one-to-one -one basic transaction of the internet is that in order to operate a service for free, you have to watch an ad. You pay with your time or your data, which is fair. But the fact that you can pay for a TV channel and still see ads, is absurd to me. What the hell were they thinking? I'm trying to look for my ultra secret room. Is this a bad idea? Probably because I will die, but <laughs> hey man, that's what funds to be had for. Can I maybe check here? This seems likely. Okay, well, I messed up. It's not here. And there goes my lost soul. He would have been alive had I not gone in here. He could have lived had it not been for me being greedy. Oh, what the fuck? I forget that chest do it as well now. <laughs> I'm always off God of Guard Blade, but that's a good chest payout. Holy crap. Yeah, Cricket's body going crazy. Holy shit. Holy shit. I'm getting hit so much though. Man, that's, that's like crazy to me. I mean, at least as far as I understand, the HD channels still run ads. Again, I've never watched them because I've... None of my... Nobody in my family, including myself, has ever considered paying for a TV channel. It seems asinine. But still, the fact that, as far as I'm aware, the broadcast is not any different is crazy to me. That's what people were saying but like, why Netflix, like, is ruining their business model as well, right? They, like, introduced, like, a new tier of, uh, of Netflix that was effectively just, like, it's, it's a bit cheaper, but you get ads now. Like, so you pay to use the service in the first place to watch the shows, and then you still have to watch ads as well. It's absolutely wild to me. It is wild to me how much, like, advertising seems to run, like, the world. Like, everything financially, anything media-related, just, like, runs on ads. Which is also crazy to me, because, like, how like tv advertising must pay a ton because a tv production is so much more expensive than like running a streaming service at least i would think like a streaming service you're pretty much only paying for service right and like having like a decent software back end or whatever but you like paid some software developers for that once and then you're good tv productions are way more expensive in my opinion at least like to run a day-to-day -day. so advertising spaces on tv must have been crazy expensive when like TV was in its heyday, right? When TV was like in its in its actual peak before the internet. That shit must have been expensive as shit. Knowing that like millions of people are gonna watch your ad, but like it's probably not very targeted advertising. Cause like how much like comparatively, how much does like online advertising pay nowadays? It must be like so much less. It must be so much cheaper, in my opinion. Cause like while it's targeted, and I guess the targetedness of the advertising may drive up prices a little bit, it's also usually a lot more niche, right? You're gonna have way less advertising space being seen. I don't know, I feel like it must pay way less. But also, if you're running an advertising firm or you're- WHAT THE FUCK?! You're trying to advertise, uh, you know, something. You're probably not buying ad spaces on TV anymore, right? I feel like that's probably also way overblown. Well, I can't believe I got glitched crown and now I get to die. <laughs> Unless... I find my item room in time, and I make a wise decision in time. I just have to actually fucking find it, which... It's proving to be a difficulty. Um, please show me something good in here. Something that will keep me alive. I mean, I I was gonna say something that will keep me alive, but like Play-Doh cookies also amazing. <laughs> give me that, and then I don't know. Give me something here. Paris, oh my fucking god! What is this run, dude? At this point, it's gone on for long enough. I don't even care if the sword drops now. That's not your cue to drop the sword game. It's not your cue to do that. I, s I swear to God, I s if, if this is the I I'm uh, I'm gonna be a little mad. Oh, it's a speed sped up room. I never should have taken that fucking stopwatch, man. What was I thinking? But also, it doesn't matter because my damage output is sick nasty. I've got a bunch of shit to choose from. I made boss rush? I guess I have been kind of rushing a little bit. I think I should gra ah, I wanted to grab eye drops, but oh well. Um, take me up today. Is there anything that gives me extra lives here? No. There's a mom's knife. There's a conjoined 
Oh no, there's Judas the Shadow, Judas the Shadow, Judas the Shadow. I gotta take that. It's after this. Now it's rotten, baby. Fuck! I fucked it up. Oh, well, we're staying in this, I guess. We're staying in the struggle. I'm telling you, Guillotine is fucking me over so much on this run. It's indescribable how much it's screwed me over so far. But I'll take that. And, well, I don't really want Mom's knife. It kind of feels like, it feels like it's going to ruin everything here. So I'll take Lil Horn. There you go. Uh, maybe something that will keep me alive in here. Oh, God. There's D6. There's... I'm just, like, trying to... Okay, there's a fucking C-section, and there's an Eden's Blessing, and I... Like, I don't know what taking... Like, taking what is gonna do, though. That's the problem. There's so much shit in here, I don't know what I can take without the other shit disappearing. That being said, I don't even care about the D6. I kind of want the C-section. <laughs> I can still get the D6 as well. Huge. Perfect. Well, this run is gonna lag my game. I wonder if the game lagging is going to make it less likely for Democles to drop because it, the frame rate is lower. <laughs> and I think it's on a per frame basis. I do want that D6 and I will grab it momentarily. I just need to kind of like clear boss rush first. Okay. So first things first. I need to grab this. I, I don't know where my body is. Oh fuck, it's the shadow right there. Okay. I need to grab that D6, which is after Stigmata, I think. Yeah, okay. Fuck, I messed that up. All right. Well, honestly, I don't care what I get here. Just give me anything. I need to... I just need to get the fuck out of here, man. I just need to get the fuck out of here. Can I use the... AWAS right here? See what the crawl space has, at least? I've fumbled so much, but it's it's all the fault of fucking guillotine. I know I said I want tractor beam earlier, but now I don't because I have C-section. want that, and then give me something here. Okay, whatever. That's better than... Better than shoop the boop. Allow me to check something real quick. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I thought maybe there was like some conflict that was making Damocles not work, but it seems to be working fine. <laughs> it's just not dropping. I'm not gonna complain. I'll be, I'll be all right uh, with it not dropping. Another A was, huh? It's a black market, huh? Well, I mean, I guess. Can I maybe get that and then? Yeah, honestly, that's good enough for me. Maybe black candle as well, actually. Just not have to worry about it in the future. And there we go. Open up, please! I know it's a bit hot right now, but please, would you be so kind? Please? I'm- I'm losing precious time! I've already lost pl plenty of it for some reason. It hasn't really caused me any trouble just yet, but still. I don't have all the time in the world is what I'm trying to say here. God, I hate Deotine so fucking much. Words cannot describe my hatred for Deotine as an item. I have indescribable anger and hatred for Deotine. Let's yeah, go. Cool. Give me chaos. I guess give me the fucking bombs, dude. There you go. I, I mistimed it and somehow still timed it right. <laughs> That's, I'm not gonna complain. That's good by me. I gotta get out of here, man. I gotta get out of here. I, I refuse to believe that my Damocles isn't broken, by the way. It should have dropped by now. There is no shot. I don't believe it. I don't believe that it is not just broken and it like is just not dropping for some reason. I don't think I'm this lucky. I, I don't think so. There's a seed if you want to test it yourself, I guess. But I feel like that's not seated, so I wouldn't know. I don't I don't know how it's happening. I don't know how it's going like this, but I won't complain. It's all guillotine, man, I'm telling you. It's all fucking guillotine that's causing me so much trouble here. Okay, well. Well, first of all, give me that. I think I need that guppy's collar here. And then I don't know what I want off of that. I don't Lump of Coal is just good with C-section, but Uranus is funny. But I'll I'll take the fucking wrong item, apparently. That's what I'll do. I'll take the wrong fucking item. You go up, your world card to get your ass out of here as fast as you can. Okay, fine, I'll go for the secret room. Why? No real reason. But I just kind of feel like it. Now it's me access to the curse room as well, which might have an item inside, you know. It's always worth checking, at least. At this point, again, anything is possible. I'll believe anything. Mainly the fact that fucking Damocles hasn't dropped yet, which is crazy to me. It's absolutely absurd, absurd unheard of. Uh, I do see the sacrum, by the way, and I'm very interested to play it, especially with the soul of Forgotten that I've been given as well. It seems like it could be a... Oh, well, there was a lost soul, apparently, or something. Bro will be such an asset to me here. Thank you. You're making me feel blessed and all that. Cheers, buddy! <laughs> oh, hey! Let's go, dude! We lived! Oh, uh, no fucking way. I can't believe that it dropped right there. So you're telling me it actually didn't drop for 32 minutes. That's crazy, dude. What the fuck? Okay. Well, I... I'm not mad. I'm actually totally fine with that. I... I... Yeah, sure. 
that time Damocles didn't want to drop. So they tell me I could have actually even beaten the run without it ever dropping if I'd gone even faster. That's a bit absurd to think about. Should I D100 for the fucking lols? <laughs> Maybe I could hold it and then, you know, use it later. Fuck it. I'll use it later. Uh, just to see where the run goes with it. It's uh, one of the zaniest runs I've ever had. And also one of the laggiest. Just every room kind of ends up like this. Really laggy. Lots of stuff going on. Lots of... Yeah, just lots of crazy shit. But yeah, isn't it crazy how, like, television is like a comp like a dying, obsolete medium? Like, there's no way... Like, you can't tell me that people still watch TV for anything but the news. And even that, you can, like, kind of get elsewhere. I guess if you're a boomer and you grew up with TV and stuff, it makes more sense. But, like... Do I want Dr. Fetus? What's Dr. Fetus and C-section synergy like? I kind of want to know. I kind of- I'm kind of curious. I think they like drop bombs when they hit enemies, right? That's kind of cool. Obviously, I don't want uh, uh Proptosis because it's kind of anti-synergy, so I'll just take that and then I'll just take anything here. Guardian Angel, okay, cool. Oh yeah, they drop bombs. And the bombs split and there's a lot of them and there's- it's scary. Okay, it's- it's very scary. I need explosion immunity, or I need to immediately reroll my run as soon as it gets dangerous. If I get hit one more time, I think, or like if I get down to low HP, I th should just D100, because otherwise I'm in trouble. <laughs> Do I rely on Guppy's uh, collar to keep bailing me out? I think I should just grab this Lazrax, just in case. Now I feel a little bit better. Now I don't have to worry until I proc Lazrax, so I think I'll be okay. Oh yeah, I got fucking Wafer too, man. I'm actually gonna be so fine. Never mind, nothing to be worried about. Okay, I mean, that's not an excuse to keep getting hit, but also there was little I could do about that. It's not like I had much of a choice in that matter. Um, at all, really. I don't have much control over whether I get hit in a room right now or not. The bombs kind of just do that, and then it's over. <laughs> the room is cleared, but also, so am I. Actually, Genesis sounds so fun, oh my god. That's Genesis right now, actually. I want to redraft my whole run. I can finally get rid of Guillotine. That's the biggest part of it. I'm finally rid of Guillotine. I shouldn't have opened these yet. I should have waited until maybe got another Glitch Crown. Oh, well, I guess I'll take them. Give me that. All right, here we go. <laughs> Just in case you thought this run couldn't get any wilder, we're about to make it wilder. I'll gladly take a rock bottom. Obviously, I'll give give me that. Oh, there's the nine lives I was hoping to find way sooner. Now I'll just take this. I'll take conjoined pieces. Oh, well, there's brimstone. Cool. Soy milk. Oh, hell yeah. Give me that constantly firing brim. That's still gonna do full damage. Why do I have an Incubus? Oh, I, I thought I started with? When you- wait, when your Genesis is eaten, you get a completely restart? Like, a complete new- what the hell? I don't want any of these, man. I'll take this for the keys, I guess. Okay, well, that's crazy, probably. Never mind, it doesn't even work. I've been scammed, what the fuck? Give me some more damage, even though it's not gonna do much for me. It's gonna take a while. Parasite, of course. Hemolacria, naturally. Chaos, to make this more interesting. More chaotic, perhaps. Warm friend is a friend, I'll take him. Oh, cool. Twisted pair as well. Oh, you shouldn't have. <laughs> you really shouldn't have. Ah, uh, that's an Arky. This is the zaniest Isaac run potentially ever. I'm not taking the Arky. It's been long enough. I've been through enough. I'm- I'm taking this, okay? And I'm living with it. Okay, I'll take the spin down dice. Oh, pff, Sacred Heart. Okay, of course. Yeah, pff, why not, right? Okay, I can- I can spin down in case there's anything cool. You know what? I forsook you earlier, I'll take you now, dead cat. Um, I guess I'll take this. Flip? Nah, dude. Infestation... 2020! I don't want Ludo, that's for sure. Oh my god, I should have shot. What was I thinking? I never should have shot. Oh, I'll take a dead eye. Uh, how many more items are there in this? I don't know, I got a lot of them. Yeah, I'll take Polyphemus, of course. Takes your damage up a little bit. Explosion immunity doesn't seem like a bad thing to have. Give me that. I'm not taking you again! Uh, there's Guppy. That's chalky milk, huh? <laughs> uh, sure, why not? Uh, see, yeah, why not? Actually, no, this isn't a, this is a passive, right? I forget that black means a passive. Oh, it doesn't matter. It was the last item anyway. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm out of here. Yeah, I'm scared of shooting. I, I, I don't know what's gonna happen as soon as I fire. Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. I only tapped the button once, by the way. I only tapped the button once uh, to, like, shoot off a little brimstone beam. And yeah. Yeah, um, I don't really know. You know, it's been a while since I had, like, a, like a game-breaking run like this. And it kind of just happened because I started with Damocles as Eden. I, yeah. Let me out, let me out, let me out, let me out, let me out. Okay, thank you.
Anything cool? And eh, whatever. I asked my D100. <laughs> right! Alright, let's just kill uh, Blue Baby in 0.25 seconds. Yep! He's dead. He's, he's dead. And you know what? I got a Void Portal. It's the best possible outcome! <laughs> Please be Delirium. Thank you. Please die. Oh yeah, he's dying. For sure. Especially if I keep shooting. I don't even know where he is. I don't know where I am. I don't know what's going on. I got hit apparently. It's not like it matters. Because uh, he's gonna die instantly. There you go. I can barely hear myself think. I've got a bit of a headache, to be honest. <laughs> Get me the fuck out of here. I want to leave, please. Thank you. It's over. I'm done. I hope you've enjoyed yourself as much as I have, because that run was insane. Uh, and I'll see you again tomorrow. Have a good one. Bye.